from 41 Seaver Way. Welcome to the home of the New York Mets. This is City Field. MLB the show with a good one coming at you. It's the Washington Nationals going up against the New York Mets. First pitch coming at you right after the break. So just about set. And our starting pitcher here today, Jose Quintana. Anytime you have five pitches to work with on the mound, that repertoire can be a real weapon in terms of keeping hitters off balance, man. It's, it's one of those things that I'm going to be looking for in this one. Does he have a feel for all of those pitches, or is he just able to get one or two over in the strike zone where he wants? Now, that's it's tough to do to be able to command all those pitches, but if he can, he is going to be very tough for the opponent today. First pick. And now it's even up. Instead of letting the hitter get his arms extended, tied him up a little bit, slightly up, slightly in. Here's a high fly ball out to center. Bader should have it. Puts it away for the out. Here's Dave Martinez lineup for the Nationals. We could be in for a power showcase today with the wind blowing out a lot of lift and separate, Chris. Well, we know guys are in this era definitely trying to hit the ball in the air regardless of the conditions, but I think even a little more so there's margin for error if you can get the ball up in the air. So, you know, you'll see at times, I'm sure, with two strikes, what looks like a half swing that can get out of the ballpark with a guy who's got decent pop. One out, base is empty. It's a little bit low. And now 2-0. Oh. No. Just missed. I almost feel like he's frustrated a little bit. He wants to be challenged. Joey Gallo waiting for a turn at the plate. Here's a 3-0. Oh. Out to short. Lindor. Whips it across, two away. Here's Joey Gallo. Both the infield and the outfield shift to the right. Pretty smart not to serve something up for him right there. He's really good at hitting the first pitch. Two outs. Just nope. missed. 2 0 count, great hitter at the dish. If you're going to miss, you've got to miss outside the zone. You miss inside the strike zone, you'll be asking the umpire for a new baseball. Next offering in there for a strike. Now two balls and a strike. Hey. And a swing and a miss. Pitches downstairs. Joey Manessis. Swing and a miss. Struck him out. It's a three up, three down in it. Middle of the first. No score after a half in it. Here at City Field. So for him, it's always interesting to see how he utilizes those weapons. He may lean on one or two pitches depending on how things are going and how things are working. But if he can control four or even five of those offerings, you look go. out, hitters. Well, it's going to be a tough day. You know He's really going to be able to keep those guys off balance. We go to the bottom of the first. And here is Brandon Nimmo. And here it comes. Fastball in for a strike. 0-1. 0-1. Oh, and and a and pitch. Popped up. Abrams. That's this one sized up. 
makes the catch, and there's one gone. Here's a Mets lineup now. They're facing a pitcher today who's prone to giving up homers, so we'll see. We might get some big swings here today. Yeah, I think the key, though, and the reason why he gives up those homers is that guys are locking in, they're aggressive, and they have a high confidence level. So I think if that's the approach these hitters take, with the stuff he's got there on the mound, yeah, there's a good chance that there'll be some balls that fly a long way. But you can't get too big in your swing. Otherwise, you'll be really f***ed after this. One down, base is empty. Swings and lines one towards the gap. And no one can get there. Takes the turn. He's digging for second. There comes the throw. There you go. Winning run is aboard with one down. Just a solid swing right there. Caught it out front and ripped it into the outfield for the base hit. Those always feel great. Winning run in scoring position now, so a clutch A-B could end this one. Francisco Lindor comes up to the plate. The switch hitter batting right. Down the ball here. Rolls foul. One out and a runner at second. And they're at the knees. Out is 0-2. Activity in the Washington bullpen. Jordan Weems getting loose out there. Floro warming up as well. The winning run on second base. One ball. The shortstop Two takes the ball. Hanks and misses. It's a strikeout. He came out of his mechanics there. Typically, he likes to shoot the ball the other way. But that time, a little anxious. And now it's the polar bear, Pete Alonzo. In the air, fairly deep to right field. Thomas moving under it. He's got it, and that'll end the inning. End of one, and we're still scoreless. Back here in Queens, new inning started. Now here is Joey Manessis. Quintana back to work. And takes low for ball one. Ball one, no strike. In there at the knees for a strike. One ball, one strike. Ricky Holiday, our umpire behind the dish, known as pretty fair umpire for both hitters and pitchers. Yeah, I think that's right, Boo. There is a little inconsistency on the corners of the plate. You can't always be sure how it's going to go with those borderline pitches as the game progresses. And another ball. Two one. And a two one hammered but foul. And he deals. Got him swinging. And that's the first out. Substitution now at second base. Coming in to run for the Nets. Nassim Nunez. Here's Eddie Rosario. Rolled softly, but that goes foul. One out, the go-ahead run to the top of the second. Pitch Whoa. misses there. Now one and two. Action in the bullpen. Drew Smith up and through. 
Lopez also getting ready. And a pitch. That one the other way. Calls it in. And there's two away. That swing right there tells me he's seeing the ball pretty well. I know it didn't produce a hit, but he made solid contact, and that's all you're looking to do anytime you're at the plate. And now it's Kiebert Ruiz. That's inside, and that's ball one. Runner at second, two down. Foul off down the right side. side and it's a one two three inning nationals leave one we'll go to the bottom of the second no score now into the game stone garrett he takes over as a new first baseman number 36 runner in scoring position no outs starling Marte up and a pitch got it started a little too early strike one that one is absolutely belted no one can get there it falls in in comes the winning Gets that a memorable moment that'll be logged in the backs of the minds of everybody that witnessed this here today. The final one to nothing for Chris Singleton and our entire outstanding crew here at MLB The Show. I'm John Shambi. We'll see you soon. The final line score for this afternoon's ball game.